Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your general daily message for Tuesday, October 8th, 2019. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box. So whomever this is meant for, I pulled a 10 card spread, five above, five below, uh, no clarifiers as of yet, uh, as well as an outcome card and two clarifiers. Quite interesting. We first start off with the air sign quality of the King of Swords. So I feel uh, this sword is literally heading towards the past. So sword represents that communication, also of the mind power as well. This tells me that in the past that that sword energy of that communication got cut off, okay? It's kind of like, nope, not going to hear from you, not going to speak to you kind of feeling, all right? But on the other side, there's the full card. Uh, literally jumping into this conversation, this communication uh, with this element of air, okay, of this uh, communication skill. Now, the thing is, is that you do have the Queen of Pentacles as well as the King of Pentacles, all right? So when you have the king and queen of the same suit, in this case, earth, does not have to be, it's all about the balance. What I'm feeling here is that somebody seriously wants communication, a new start with the full card here, leaping into that element of the communication, okay? Not overly happy in regards to this relationship with the king and queen here, both of them here, all right? The thing is, is that I'm feeling that somebody's coming in for a big surprise. That's what I'm seriously feeling. Jump ahead to, hang on, I'll be going back. The higher font, major arcana made, you know, means that relationship, that commitment here. That in the past, there was no love. There was no communication. There was no love offer here, okay? Now, I also feel that somebody is going to get like a sneak attack feeling of that surprise element in regards to that communication of love, all right? Because the page of cups is kind of like, here you go, and here you are, or whoever this is for is kind of like, I really want this relationship. I really want this balance. That pentacle represents that balance. That's what I'm feeling here. It's kind of like your head is down. You're focused on the relationship and in comes this page. Pages are known for that communication. The cup is that love. There's going to be an offer. Absolutely. Especially with the outcome being the way that it is. This is an interesting energy that I'm picking up in, in regards to the male energy, meaning that king of pentacles here. I was chosen to use, I hear you, I was chosen to use this deck for a reason. I feel it's because this Rider Waite deck in particular, for some odd reason, he has his eyes closed, okay? So it's kind of like with the Emperor here, could be dealing with an Aries as well, but for the overall energy, you see how his eyes are shifted over? It's kind of like, get your act together. You know, the, <laughs> sorry, the energy of that uh, Emperor, he's a very controlling energy. So it's kind of like, how do I put this? It's kind of like... <laughs> it's like somebody has finally woken up, okay, from a very deep sleep. Sees, is kind of like, okay, this is what I'm feeling here. It's kind of like, dude, like, start taking control over your life. Be that king of pentacles. Have that balance. Open your eyes, my son. You know, that's what it feels like to me. It's like, it, exactly. It's time to get the ball rolling here is what I'm feeling here. It's time to take control over the situation is what this is saying from this emperor. It's kind of like, dude, you've been sleeping way too long here. Your eyes have been closed too long. It's time to take control of the situation. That's what I'm feeling here because I feel that he, that this emperor energy, okay, could be dealing with a twin as well. But regardless, I feel that somebody is kind of not just frustrated, well, the feminine is. That's what I'm feeling because the Queen of Pentacles is right above it. So that's your energy in regards to feminine energy. But I'm also feeling that the King, that that King of Pentacles, more so related to the Emperor energy here, is kind of like, I'm frustrated. You know, I'm frustrated that I can't get my act together. Uh, and I feel that the feminine energy, I know I'm picking sides here, but take what applies because it is a general read. It's been a long time coming, all right? With the Knight of Cups here, that Knight is that slow pace. What's wild is, is that the Page of Cups is right there, all right? Opposite direction. So I feel that somebody's going to have a sneak attack is what I'm seriously feeling here and offering that cup of love. I feel that there, there is one more card, I know. Uh, I feel that there is lack of communication from the past. I feel the feminine energy wants to have a new start here. I feel that somebody from the male Division. I only say that's because the Emperor and the King of Pentacles are right next to each other, but please take what applies. 
I feel that they are going to be coming in with this communication, this offer of love. I feel that it's definitely been postponed in regards to this relationship, for lack of better words. I feel that the feminine energy was frustrated with the male. Absolutely. But I am also feeling it's kind of like that the male energy was frustrated with himself is what I'm really feeling here. It's kind of like, I know, they always say this example, but it's kind of like slap of the head. I should have had a VA. Why didn't I come to my senses sooner kind of thing? That's what I'm feeling here because of that Knight of Cups. Now, right after the Knight of Cups, you have the Hermit. So I feel that somebody is definitely manifesting, okay? Definitely deep in their thoughts about somebody returning after quite some time is what that tells me to heal the situation as well in regards to this relationship. I definitely feel that somebody has been really, really focused on them returning for quite some time to the point where they are manifesting for this person to return. But I do feel that there's definitely some type of communication because yeah, but you have two pages. Pages is that communication. Yeah, see, that's what I'm feeling. The blindfold is over the eyes. I feel that there will be a decision made and this person is not going to see this coming in. This apology, the, king, the uh, page of pentacles is known for an apology as well as communication to bring that balance back in. With the queen and the king of the same suit, in this case, that pentacle, somebody wants to proceed with this relationship, okay, for a better, brighter future. This dude is literally saying, hey, shall we start again? You know, that's what I'm feeling in regards to, could be dealing with an apology as well, definitely feeling out of the blue, not seeing this coming, this decision being made, and this offer coming in, absolutely. But the sun card is actually known as the best card. It's also known as the yes card. So this just confirms, especially with two pages here, there's definite communication, whomever this is meant for. So that is what I have. I hope that this helps, guys. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Also, click that little bell on the side to get updated information. You guys rock. Stay strong, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.